Now, we saw in the earlier videos, what do you mean by linear equation in two variables? Let us now see as to, you know, how many solutions are possible for a linear equation in two variables. Let's say you have a linear equation 2x plus 7y plus 4 is equal to 0. Okay? Suppose this is a linear equation in two variables that you have. Then you can say that 2x plus 7y is equal to minus 4. Right? Now, let us start with the values, putting in the values for x and y. Let's say x is equal to 1, okay, and y is equal to minus 6 upon 7. If we take these values, will this be satisfied? So this equation will look like 2 into 1 plus 7 into minus 6 divided by 7 or 2 minus 6 is equal to minus 4. So therefore, this equation is satisfied by the value of x is equal to 1 and y is equal to minus 6. Now suppose x is equal to 0, okay, then if I put this value here in this example, this will give me 2 into 0 plus 7y is equal to minus 4 or 7y is equal to minus 4 and y is equal to minus 4 by 7. So x is equal to 0 and y is equal to minus 4 by 7. So both these values are satisfying this equation. Similarly, if I put x is equal to 2, then what I notice is 2 into 2, 2x, two, 2 times x, 2 times 2, plus 7y is equal to minus 4, or 7y is equal to minus 4, now this is 4, if I take it to the other side, again it becomes minus. Or y is equal to minus 8 by 7. So by doing this, what we find out is that the linear equation in two variables has infinite solutions. So there could be infinite values which can satisfy a linear equation in two variables. Unlike a linear equation in one variable where you had only one solution to a particular equation. So a linear equation in two variables can have infinitely many solutions.